Dr. Craig Nossel, I'm Head of Vitality Wellness uh, at Discovery Vitality. Discovery Vitality was launched in 1997 and today we have over 6 million members across the globe. We're seeing an increased burden of disease uh, and a lot of it is driven by our sedentary lifestyles. And we look in the work environment, the work day is very sedentary. We're at computers, we're sitting, uh, we're just not active enough. And this isn't just about the health of the employees, but also about what we call the fourth bottom line. So the health of the actual business that's investing in their employee base. The positive impact for a company has really become more and more clear as we see more and more of the research coming through. What is interesting within a wellness program is that it's not just about keeping the healthy people healthy, but how do you start to impact the people that wouldn't normally come into a gym environment and wouldn't normally be active? Hi, my name is Steve Murray. I'm the Operations Director at Activate Health. Activate's vision is to positively impact on the chronic disease burden using the power of physical activity as both a treatment and a prevention modality. Our corporate strategy is to specifically assist the employer to get employees active, keep them active, but more than that, to measure the very specific health outcomes that physical activity can produce. When we looked at our vision and the requirements that our customers had, there was only one choice for us, the Technogym My Wellness Cloud, the digital solution, because the ability of that single platform to connect the end user with a range of different professionals that are going to guide and motivate that person along their wellness journey was unprecedented. This together with the open nature of the platform, which allows us to collect workout data from a range of different fitness devices and allows us to keep that contact with our customer wherever they are was important, both inside and outside the clinic. What is important is the role of technology. The techno gym equipment that we see in, the, in many gym facilities, the ability to track, to upload one's data, so sharing the technology with friends as a motivator, sharing it with healthcare professionals, whether it's a doctor, a dietitian, a biokinetist, that they're able to access this information and help support their patients. So having an on-site facility, particularly when they're world-class facilities, having a wellness program within the corporate environment we see a much greater engagement in people exercising. My name is Maurice McDowell. Um, I'm a quality specialist here at Barclays. I think Barclays did a great job in terms of bringing gyms into their, their campuses. We constantly talk about a work-life balance. So we put in a lot of effort while we're at work. And I think the business allowing us the opportunity to have a gym is great. It's really energizing to be able to come in and do a workout. Your mind is clear walking into meetings. With the cloud, it's great. I don't have to remember anything. I can just stick my key in. It tells me what's the next exercise. It tracks my exercises for me, so I don't even have to count. From week to week, you can view your achievements. You can see how you're doing year to date. I think everybody would love to have their own personal trainer, but the app and the cloud actually provide that for me. The fact that my coach tracks it as well, and once a week or twice a week, we'll just pop in and will pop me a message. Definitely by using the My Wellness Cloud, uh, my results have improved drastically from where I was. My name is Dr. Georgia Torres and I'm the Medical Wellness Director for Activate Health. We designed the member journey specifically to impact health outcomes. We established the health risk via the Technology My Wellness Cloud using the HRA of the American College of Sports Medicine. The next step in our journey was to prescribe the exercise program for a high-risk individual. Through our Technogym My Wellness platform, we designed six 12-week interventions. When analyzing this journey and this methodology, we ran an initial trial and we analyzed 251 members. So we were able to show that for the employee and the employer, the productivity loss that occurred from reducing cardiovascular risk factors was 42%. And that was a result of absenteeism decreasing by 40% and presentism um, decreasing by 60%. Research has showed that changing one risk factor has an annual save of $950 per person per year to the employer. What we've seen when we look at the data from our health business and our life business is that people engaged in the program have a much lower hospitalization rate and overall their costs are significantly lower. When we look at our life base, we've seen about 14 years difference in the longevity uh, of members that are on the Vitality Programme, which not just for us as a business is important, but from a society point of view is also critical.